In today's Einstein Healthcare Science Center report, Pennsylvania is making a big commitment to technology education for girls. As KYW News Radio reporter Justin Udo explains, the state is taking aggressive action to get young women involved in the tech industry. Girls Who Code uses after-school programs and in-school curriculums to get young women interested in technology. If we care, and I do deeply, about equity, about opportunity for women, for communities of color, we have to make sure that we're exposing our young people to computer science as early as we possibly can. During a Girls Who Code event at William D. Kelly School in West Philadelphia, Pennsylvania First Lady Frances Wolf talked about PA Smart, the state's $20 million investment in STEM and computer science training for K-12 students. We don't want women to be left behind. Behind. We don't want girls to be left behind, and so we're, in, you know, giving them the extra push to 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 join uh, the workforce in a stronger fashion. Part of that push is ramping up programs like Girls Who Code by helping them expand from the 150 schools in Pennsylvania that they are already in. So we're going to get that curriculum in the hands of every single Pennsylvania student, boys and girls. During the day, the girls got to see just how many careers and opportunities exist through coding and technology, and they say that has sparked a new interest in their lives. It's more than just regular normal jobs. You could get paid from, as a kid starting at the age I am now, you could like be making money from coding. For Tatiana Gray, an eighth grader at William D. Kelly who wants to be an OBGYN, the coding exercises and informational sessions showed her that tech is applicable to what she wants to do. It's a lot of stuff that you could do that's on a computer or using technology. During the event, the girls got to hear from women who work in the tech industry. It made me feel like that I could do anything. We want to show that to girls in technology because when they think about a technologist, they think about like a guy sitting in a basement somewhere and typing at it. They don't see themselves. Right now, Girls Who Code works with 90,000 girls of all backgrounds in all 50 states. Justin Udo, KYW News Radio for CBS 3 Eyewitness News. Great program. Mm -hmm. well,